Hello everybody. Let's talk about toilets in Space Engineers. This is Eichester's toilet, and this is probably the only toilet in any mod. I've never seen another toilet. It's a good enough model, but as you can see, it looks really lonely in its own little voxel. It does well on small ships, but it looks bad on large ships. And like the reactor, the problem isn't the core model. The problem is how it's combined with other things. This is basically the smallest bathroom you can make, and it just looks so awkward. And it doesn't look realistic at all. I mean, who has a bathroom like this? So, the first thing I did was create my own toilet. Now, I'm not sure. I've got a couple of things left to tweak on this, so I don't think this is the final form. But one of the things you'll notice is that it's about 30 or 40 percent bigger than the other toilet. So it does fill the space larger, and it looks more realistic to me. Uh, his toilet seems really tiny. But it's not intended to fill the space alone. That doesn't fix anything. Instead, what I've done is I've created some variants that integrate other kinds of things into the toilet space. So here, for example, is an integrated toilet with a sink and some cleaning supplies and some stuff like that. And it's perfect for, you know, an officer's cabin or something where they've got their own uh, setup. I've also created a space toilet, which is a us useful in zero gravity, and that's this. I haven't painted it, so it's pretty drab. But uh, the space toilet works in zero gravity, looks good, and also fits into one cell. Similar to that, I've created stalls. So you can build yourself a facility bathroom. Now one of the things I'm thinking about doing is adding doors to the front of these and turning the stall into a door block. But I don't know how doors work, uh, so I'll have to try and figure that out. If you've built a door before, let me know so that I can figure out how to do it based on your experience. And there are some of Eichester's sinks over there. Now to show you how much better this looks than your average setup, I've built myself a little officer's quarters. So this is a little officer's quarters with one little bed uh, and a little cabinet, and then you just turn over and here's a bathroom with a shower and a toilet. Pretty good, right? Super basic, much, much smaller and tighter than you can get with the ordinary stuff. Another thing worth noting is that in addition to having construction stages, these have level of detail stages. So by the time you get out to here, they weigh almost nothing. They, they are only a maybe not even a hundred faces. They're super lightweight. Which means that if you st stuff your ship full of them, it's not going to cause you to have severe slowdown on your, um, on your piloting. Because when you're out in piloting view, you're going to be far enough away that that's not going to be a problem. If we were going to look at this more exactly, I've got a camera on this thing. And let's just compare the number of verts in Eichester's toilet to the number of verts in my toilet. See? I don't believe his toilet has any level of detail mods at all, meaning that you are really, really uh, um, getting some heavyweight stuff with his, with his stuff. I think that what happened is he... I get the feeling he uh, obtained these models from another project and didn't bother to integrate in any kind of level of detail stuff. But I did, and it makes my toilets super, super easy to uh, to use. You don't have a lot of slowdown when you use them. Right now we're on a camera at 8 times zoom. It's not nearly that obvious if we're not in a camera, as you can see. And also they're interior, so it's not like that would be something that happens very often. Um, well, I have uh, got the dancing leg bug. So I guess that's uh, where I'll stop. Basically, I want to ask you whether or not I should put this mod onto the uh, Steam Workshop as is, or whether I should refine it a little bit more. There are still some things I'd like to put in. There's, I'd like a standalone sink. I'd like my own set of showers. There are two different kinds of showers I'd like to add that are different from the kind of shower that, these, that they've got. And I'd like to add my own uh, laundry bins and uh, places to store laundry. And I'd like to add my own washing and drying machines. But do you guys want to wait for that stuff? Do you want to wait for me to figure out how to make doors work? Or do you just want me to start spamming the workshop? Let me know.